Well, turning now to the latest tragedy in our city, a 15-year-old shot and killed when shots rang out on the streets of Brooklyn. Fox 5's Lisa Evers joining us live from the scene in Bensonhurst. Lisa, we understand you spoke with the boy's father today. Yes, we did, Chris and Natasha, and I can also tell you that right now an NYPD manhunt is underway for a 17-year-old gunman who police say opened fire on a group of teens who were coming out of summer school yesterday afternoon. Police say this gunman shot and killed a 15-year-old, and now his grieving father is speaking out. Members of Brooklyn's closely knit Uzbekistan community stopped by the Bensonhurst home of 15 year old Faradun Mavlinov to console his heartbroken father. In this surveillance video, when a 17 year old gunman covered up in a mask and a hoodie takes aim and fires. Detectives were able to identify the 17 year old male and we're actively looking for him right now. Faradun, who was training in judo, is seen in this photo with his proud dad, Firdovs Malinov. I am Barber. Everybody knows my son. The other teens ran for their lives. The grieving father says he rushed to the scene and followed the ambulance to the hospital. At first, he was hopeful his son would make it. Then came the devastating reality. After they go to hospital, his heart came in working. And then uh, almost uh, started 2, 2 p.m. Uh, surgery and uh, 7 p.m. he finished surgery and blood nothing stopped. Many of the men in the neighborhood know the family and stopped by to lend whatever support they could, knowing nothing could undo an unendurable loss. This is not only his loss, this right. is everyone's loss. Everyone, we are raising our kids and children, right, children? So we need more safety. We need more safety for our streets and, and our city. Now, the heartbreak and despair in this community is real, and a sense of futility is growing, especially among the dads who came out here to support this grieving father. Some of them telling us that no matter what you do, even if you keep your child out of trouble, that's no guarantee you'll be able to keep them alive. We are live in Bensonhurst. I'm Lisa Evers, Fox 5 News. Chris and Natasha, back to you.